guys welcome back to my channel today I am going to be going through my cash envelopes and I am going to be redoing the writing on them and so I want to show you when you have cash envelopes that are laminated how easy it is to change the titles to modify them or whatever it is that you need so if you're interested in seeing how i modify my cash labels and how easy it is to write on them and break down my envelopes then stay tuned to this video okay so as you guys can see here i was trying to practice calligraphy and all best temps, attempts aside, it looks silly. And so I am just going to be grabbing a paper towel that I have here and then folding it up. And then I have rubbing alcohol that you guys can see here. Okay, so all you need to do is take the rubbing alcohol and it will take the writing right off. So you guys can see it's kind of like a dry erase board feel to it. It's just super easy to take everything off as I shoot my cards across. So now I have a brand new clean slate to set that envelope up. And so I'm just gonna keep going with as much as I can do on one paper towel. And so that one is my utilities and I do have, I will be having these envelopes in my Etsy store. Like this one will be called get lit because it's got the lights. And I just think that's super cute for utilities. This is going to make my hands an absolute mess. And I know that you guys can't tell so much in the pictures, but if you check this out, it's got a hollow look behind it and it is a really pretty, it's kind of like a seaweed hollow. Like this one had a printing error, which is why it's my own personal, but it, the, the paper is just so beautiful. I need to just feature them on my Instagram so that you can see the true beauty of everything. And so, um, my calligraphy, I was trying my best but it's not quite what I want it to look like. My daughter's like, mom, what did you do? This is a hot mess. And so I want to start over. And that's the great thing about having these is I have that as an option. And so my envelopes are sliding all over the place. This is, and so how cool is that? This was just a permanent marker. And then I'm just going in with rubbing alcohol and it all comes right off. So I am gonna go ahead and just speed through wiping all of these off so that I can get ready to relabel them. weekly budget and so this is the breakdown of what all of the envelopes that I'm gonna need so I am going to set that aside and then here are all of my envelopes plus I'm going to need to pull out a few extra and then here are three that are punched and these are going to be used for things that I keep in my wallet I want to come straight down my list and I want to decide which envelope is going to be for which category and I have this one with the little houses right here and this is going to be for my mortgage so I have these labels from Regina Laughs 
that I will be using on some of the envelopes like the mortgage here. And so I want to do mortgage. I want to make sure you guys, I'm in shot mortgage. So I'm just gonna take that right up here and put this right on the top. I do have some of the permanent markers stuck on my nails, so just ignore that. So I've got mortgage, that is our first category. And then I need one for our line of credit. I'm gonna go with this one. And I am gonna use a label on this one as well. Edward Jones, I was using this one. And so I am kind of liking the labels. I'm deciding if I want to just have labels at the top or if I want to write on these. I think I'm going to go with labels, guys. And so this one, I'm going to go here. Okay, so then we've got Dominion, which is our gas bill for at home. So I am going to do that on this one here. We've got our Mazda. Just gonna put the Mazda. For someone, this one feels like the Honda. So I'm gonna do the Honda on this one here. And then I am going to do the Mazda on this one. So we've got Mazda Honda. This is our utilities. Orthodontist, I am going to do on this one here. This one is going to be the Sirius FM. Oh, I keep saying FM and then it's XM. The yard maintenance, actually gonna use this one here. And I'm gonna go yard maintenance. And then Netflix. I guess I'll just use this one. And I'm gonna go gray. Okay, so for all of our fixed expenses, which are right down here, I went ahead and put little labels on each of the envelopes. And that's going to help me remember that these go in the fixed expenses category. And so next I want to do six cards, six envelopes for our debts. So I'm 
So I'm going to do this one, this one, this one. We want to move to the beach someday. I am going to use all beach theme for that. And I want to make sure that you can see. And so I am going to be using permanent marker on these. There is Kohl's. This is J. Barclay. This is going to be Target. one is going to be L Barclay. Capital One. And Lending Club. So there we have our debts. And then this is going to be these envelopes I keep in my wallet. So I have three left. And as you can see, I have a lot more than three over here. So I am going to go, <laughs> I have a lot more than three right here. I am going to go pick out my envelopes for all of this and I will be right back. Okay, so I'm back and I have my envelopes all picked out here. So this is for groceries. I think it is super cute and just totally obvious it's for groceries. So I'm not even gonna put a label on that one. This one is for his spending. And then I'm going to come back and make it cute later. This one is my spending. And it says gratitude changes everything. Lovely day. This one here I want to do for clothes. This is going to be for dog food. This is going to be for vet, vet slash pet. This one here is going to be for for gas. This one is going to be for dentist. This one is going to be medical. going to be date night. This one's going to be family. Family fun. This one is so cute and I am going to do it for toiletries. This is going to be for gifts and this is going to be snowball.
Okay. So now I have taken all of our categories, and this is quite a few envelopes. So let's see at what point did they get flipped upside down. So there are quite a few envelopes here, but this is where we're starting our journey. So you can see there's a lot of different categories, but there you have it. And then like I showed you at the beginning of this video, if I ever decide I don't like the writing or I want to change it, it's just as simple as going in and taking some rubbing alcohol and I can wipe all of that off. But for now, these are going to be our envelopes. And so you guys saw there was various ways. You can do it with labels, like all of these. You can do it printing with a Sharpie or a wet erase marker. Okay, so now I'm gonna get ready and do the envelopes for this week. So if you're interested in checking that out, I will link to that video up in the tags above and you can head on over and you can watch my envelope stuffing. All right guys, see you soon, bye.